We are live here. Uh, Labor Day. Kidding, guys. I worked over 2011, <laughs> September 5th. Paddle wheel excursions. Last, last day for paddle wheel excursions. First, first ride was in 1961, 50 years. Many of you cannot be here today, so we're going to bring this to you live right now. It's a very sad day. We had, uh, we've got people here and strollers, people in wheelchairs. It's a family ride, and it's a, it's a sad day here. Here at Top Row Paddle Wheel, we're taking the up zero beat, dropping it down zero beat, going about five miles an hour in three point eight minutes. Are you ready? <laughs> well, that's good because we already left. My name is Captain Devin. I'll be driving you guys around the lagoon today and driving you crazy with my terrible jokes. Today they're sponsored by Cheetos. Yes, they're cheesy. Yes, they're corny. But no, they won't get stuck in your teeth. And they don't turn your fingers towards you. But, but if you've already ridden, they are stale. Sorry. Take a look out to the right, you'll see Camden, founded in 1999, and it's home to eight big, bad kitty machines. Six of which you adults can ride all by yourselves. Well, calm down, guys. We're going right back to the docks. Just take a lap when you get out the exit, hit up Woodstock Express. It's a great little coaster, taller and faster than Cedar Creek Mine Ride, faster than Iron Dragon. Those aren't jokes, those are facts. Pretty intense for a kitty coaster. Yeah. Now off to the right there's Cedar River Charters with Captain Hook Finn. Now that photographer has been shooting them and flashing them all day. So we had to call security. He says he's afraid. Well, we'll see what the hell is. Hopefully nothing too bad to get that picture. There's two of our musical celebrities, Lawrence Elk and John Kilgar. Currently touring as Elk and John. They're opening up for Lion L. Richie and Barry E. Manilow. Check it out. It's a great show. It's at the zoo. The little ones probably want Justin Bieber. Sorry, difference in it. Two and Oh, goodness. Soldier, wives, wives, soldier, children, many six ladies, soldier, captain, I'm scared too. Simply wooden guns with wood, wooden bullets. Yes, there goes wooden people wood. shooting wooden bullets out of wooden guns. And if one wishes it, it wouldn't hurt. That's right. <laughs> Off to the right there, Snake River Falls. The ride's so classy, you don't even need a shirt to go on it. <laughs> And you don't even need to go on it to get soaked. You can just stand on the bridge out front. You're welcome. I just saved you all that time waiting in their non-existent line to cool off. Off to the right here we have Shoot the Rabbit. Now they say you can judge a ride by its popularity, so... Ta-da! Yeah. Yeah. There's that family ride that they put in last year that no one ever goes on. I mean, what a poor management decision. Kidding. Shoot the Rapids is actually an excellent ride. New to the park in 2010, it features two lift hills, one of 85 feet, one of 49. Both of them take you up and drop you down into raging rapids of super clean Lake Erie water. Yeah, you come out of there smelling like a rose or something. Now off to the right, there's the town of Seville. Does anyone want to take a guess as to what we call the citizens of Seville? Civilians, plastic, mannequin, etc. <laughs> Celebrities, because they are fake and plastic. <laughs> Tell them whatever you want, they won't respond. Might as well round out the repertoire of jokes there. Round two of the guessing game. What is above us right now? Life jackets. Sky. I'm Captain Devin. This is Captain Obvious. Uh -huh. And that's Millennium Force, uh -huh. the number one steel coaster in the world. Not too far behind it are Magnum XL 200 at number 7, Top Thrill Tracks are at number 10, and hey, Raptor's even on the list at number 21. Yeah. Now off to the right, there's Grandpa Bob out fishing with Timmy and Jimmy. Now Timmy's the one with the fish. Jimmy's that little sport in the middle. Yeah, don't worry. If you didn't catch it, it'll sink in. On the left, it's our local aviation specialist, Delbert Feinstein. Now, normally he would try and fly a little boat, but he stayed out a little too late last night, and Mom got mad. So now he's grounded. He stayed out too late last night, his mom got mad, and so he's grounded. They can't quite make it to the end. Yes, I'm from Michigan. Yes, it stings to tell that joke. 
He used to play that guitar by hand, now he plays it by ear. Their debut album went to the top ten. It was awesome. Now on the right, he's been playing that same spot for 47 years. Mama Bear got mad because her cubs were playing out in their bare feet. Papa Bear's mad because the cubs haven't had a winning season, and well, we don't even know when the last time the cubs had a winning season. <laughs> This guy here is going to sell that stuff. Swine cooler on the midway. Flavor of hogwash. Mm. We don't need a captain on this boat because I'm on it. Here we come into the docks here. As we said, the final day of operation for paddlebill boat excursions. Been in operation for 50 years. A true family ride here at Cedar Point. Quite a sad day. Very nice. Now here's Charlie. He's our doctor spaniel. Jeez, Charlie, what are you doing? These people wanted a nice ride.